<laughs> Medical experts say that people getting vaccinated is what it's going to take for us to get back to normal. And today, people in the cheese making industry say they've got a plan. Evan Peterson shows us how people in the curd community plan to achieve herd immunity. It's been a, a roller coaster of uh, ups and downs. For the better part of the pandemic, essential food producers have been asking when the vaccine becomes available, when can we get it? Been a lot of reevaluating of our general workplace. Um, and now with vaccinations with, uh, you know, Group 1B being the dairy producers, it's been, it's been very comforting as a, a majority of our staff has gone and got vaccinated. And the answer for those in the business of getting cheesy is now. For us as a small business, a COVID outbreak here for our 30 employees means uh, us being able to make cheese spread or not make cheese spread. The folks over at Pine River Prepack, a producer of spreadable cheeses, say the vaccine is its employees' top priority. Encourage them to do it during work hours so they could be paid to travel to uh, Walgreens to get their vaccination and back. Even bigger cheese producers like Sargento Foods are reporting major initiatives to achieve herd immunity. We're fortunate um, in all of our facilities to have an on-site health and wellness center. Um, and we were approved through our um, the administrator of those health and wellness centers to be able to give doses of the vaccine right on site. We're working closely with um, uh, Meyer, um, the retail chain Meyer, through their pharmacy network to do an on-site um, mass vaccination. A move that will help more than half a dozen food production companies located in the Sheboygan area get their vaccine too. Evan Peterson, Fox 6 News.